Hey, it's me Risha. Today I am sharing you how to create a new urban style glitch YouTube intro for your videos. So before you start, watch my previous two videos, the transition and the glitch title. If you don't subscribe my channel, please hit on the subscribe button. You must download the title and transition from my YouTube channel and also download the elements from my description link and this is the footage you must prepare your footage for before you starting and now open your premiere and this project window you need to create a new project so go to file new then project set a name and choose a location for saving project file and okay now you need to create a new sequence so go to sequence create new sequence i choose a full hd and change the name into intro 10 1080 30 fps now this is our interface i will just prepare my interface now you need to import your footage into project window so you can import your project footage into a folder so we need to this is our lm footage so we need to create a new folder so change the name into footage and if you double click on this uh, folder it's come like this and if you double click on alt then double click is just come like this so i just change my preference into edit preference and i think not in timeline i think in general in general setting not in here maybe yeah i think general setting yeah here the bin double click open in new window i change it like to this so if you just if you just double click on open in a new window so i just import all footage into this new folder and create a another folder and change the name into elements because this is not necessary but it help for more organi organizing and more easier for working and import the downloaded elements into this elements folder now this is my footage i dock the window with nearest my program window now let us start uh, just save the project so yeah so my recording obs studio now i create a new sequence and change the name into scene one because actually we are working in with three scenes this is the scene one and you can see here this is scene one you need to import your first footage into scene one so just drag and drop your first footage into scene one and just zoom timeline using plus button now go to in draw if you have any doubt and just drag and drop the scene into the in draw if you have any problem i just close the scene one this is our in draw sequence and this is our scene one sequence just drag and drop the scene one sequence into the in draw sequence so because if you want to change the video just go to scene inside the scene change the video so now just install the essential graphics title you can see how to install in my previous videos now just drag and drop the glitch title into the first yeah, it's look like this and go to the fx control and you can change the scale the size of the whole title now it's look like this i just reduce the total size of I think it's 15 frames or it must be a less than one second say 20 22 frames like that just decrease the duration again yeah I think this is good 
Now, this is good. If you up uh, press the up arrow or down arrow in keyboard, you can go to the the starting or the ending of a clip and just shift and uh, two three times arrow key in keyboard and cut the video split the video by control K and because we want to add a transition in here go to IPC transition you can install transition in my previous video and apply the zoom out smooth B version now it's okay I just decrease the total duration of the scene one. And this is good. And create another sequence and change the sequence name into a scene two because this is our second scene. And choose the full HD 30 FPS, the same sequence before we use. Now, this is the scene two and import the videos into scene 2 and here is we are using a split screen so we need to show the three we can show three video in one scene so import your three videos into this one into this scene and but it should be the, the top of everyone in the top of and select the top video and just decrease the scale into 50 percentage and change the position like this and now we need to import the second footage I just set the in and out marker and like this and change the scale to frame size and change the scale value into 50 percentage now change the position like this okay so because we can we can show the three videos in a single frames now i think the bottom video is 4k we need to change the scale to frame size so this change to scale frame then we can change the position like this set the position the perfect position i think center base is okay so if you play the the three video you can see is playing now it's good now go back to the intro sequence now and drag and drop the scene to into the intro sequence like this and I just decrease the total duration of the scene to as as with this scene to duration into total is five second and you can decide with around your music beats or something like that now i just cut the ending the five frames and the starting 15 frames of this clip and apply that glitch transition and for this so i just copy alt click and drag these two footage and because you can see how to apply the glitch transition in my previous video the transition video and apply the b and a for 
and V for second footage. Now you need to apply the glitch A, B for both top videos. Now it's look like this. So you need to change the blending mode of this top video into go to fx control and here is the opacity under the opacity blending mode change into hard light so you can get the nice chromatic operation so we apply the glitch transition if you have any doubt go to my previous transition video you can get the link from this video description link and how to use so we perfectly done the second scene now create a, the last scene scene 3 and up, uh, drag and drop the last video into the scene 3 sequence and just close that scene and drag and drop into the main in row sequence this is our last scene so I need to cut the my in row this is my in row so seven second so i already said you can decide based on your music beats so you must select a music before you start and i just crop my the ending five frames and starting th 15 frames and apply split transition to this so i use vertical you can use any of this decay or horizontal and apply the vertical end to first footage and vertical b into second one which look like this now if you play our basic transition our basic intro is okay next part is how to detail this intro into like professional and I just drag into the bottom. We don't waste our time in space. So next we need to add a lot of elements. So we need more space. So hope you enjoyed and let's see what to do.